I'd had all these ideas for a, a very new show, partly or actually inspired by Kepler. So Johannes Kepler, you, you probably know, he wrote a very beautiful little book called The Six Cornered Snowflake, which um, you can get today. It's still in print. You can get it on Kindle. It was about uh, an experience he had in 1609. He writes it was New Year's Eve, uh, 1609. It's a beautiful story, though. He was walking across the Charles Bridge in Prague from the observatory to his patron's house for a party on New Year's Eve. And he realised he hadn't bought his patron a present. And, and then he noticed snowflakes landed on his arm. And he looked at them and he got interested in why they're all six-cornered. His book's called The Six-Cornered Snowflake. So what is the origin of this symmetry of the snowflakes? Uh, and, and so he went to the party and he said to his benefactor, I have brought you the gift of almost nothing, because I, I know how fond you are of nothing. <laughs> but he said, in that gift of almost nothing, which is the snowflake, you can read the entire universe which is a beautiful line. And, and so in this book, he hey, speculates. I gotta tell you, that's the worst freaking gift <laughs> well, no, that I have Kepler, ever heard. If you showed up at my house with a 